Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I decided to do a makeup collection with you guys and a little tour of my vanity that I sort of created in a way. Um, I just want to share my makeup with you, what I've been using, what I've been loving, just to show you a little bit here and there to give you like ideas for the beginners who are doing makeup because I am a beginner, I'm not a professional and I'm just like kind of learning and getting the hang of it using techniques how to apply makeup and all that fun stuff also i have makeup brushes that are really affordable that you can definitely buy and what i've been loving and you might like it as well so i'm just going to be showing the whole makeup that i have um and where i purchase all this stuff just to give you an idea to start your makeup and just to give you an idea to create your own vanity and also you can use it as to do your homework as well. Yeah, so let's get into the video and let me show you my makeup products. I also have this turtle iced coffee. Gosh, it is beyond delicious. A lot, it's just I'm holding this. Okay guys, so the first thing when you enter, this is my room. Um, my room is really small, it has two doors obviously, but what we have here is this chair right here. I got this chair at um, RC Willy and I got it for $20, it's really good, I really like it because $20 you cannot beat that and it's just, I like it. It turns around, you can make it lower, higher, you can adjust your seat and it's just really cool. I got this toss pillow at RC Willy as well and it's really cool i really like it i think i got it for free um i don't remember but it's really cute i really like it because it goes with the chair it's just a little add-on something just to look pretty i always have my chair uh, looked this way when people come in they just can like oh there's a chair they can sit down so that's where i got this at rc woolly good price and good deals i have these two frames and i actually got them at bed bath beyond Original price, they were $9.99 each, but I got two for $10 because they was on sale. They were closing Bed Bath Beyond, and I took advantage of that deal. The first frame, it says Make Things Happen, which is really cute, and it's just a white frame. And then it has this, like, pink, and it has a little clip on it, which is really cute. The second one, it says Good Vibes Only. Obviously, you want good vibes in your room, and yeah, for the house and, you know, the entrance. So, yeah. So, these are really good deals, and at two for $10, so you cannot beat that, guys. Just really amazing, and I really like it. It's just so pretty, the colors, and yeah. So, right here, I have my candle, and I got that candle at Target. It smells really good. I always turn it on every time I wake up in the morning or even at night when I'm reading. Um, here I have this welcome little um, frame thing. I got it at Hobby Lobby and it was actually on sale for $5. And of course there's little scratches because I took it out of the back and I dropped it on the floor and then look what happened there's like little scratches on it but i like it because it has like little tattoos and all that cute and it says welcome i just really like it it's so cute next i have these two candles this one's a small one i think it's a large one or i'm not so sure um but i got those candle holders at rc willy and i it was actually a gift i got it for christmas and that was very thought of him for getting me those for christmas i just really like them it's just really good with my vanity or slash dust whatever you want to call it um but it's really cute i'm so in love with it i just love it because it's like so pearl and cute i just i really love it um, candles is coconut courtesy and i actually got them at hobby lobby my mom actually purchased it for me and there were 50% off, so my mom took advantage of that. The Hobby Lobby has, like, good sales, guys. Um, normally, every week, they have, like, frames on 50% off, candle holder, flowers, decorations, um, wall arts. So, if you guys want to go and want to save money, you should definitely go to um, Hobby Lobby. They always have good sales. Um, but, yeah. So, I really like how this looks. So, right here, I have this little um, runner. Um, of course, I got dirty because my vanity is white. So, I definitely don't want to get it dirty. So, I put this runner on top of it. It has a little pumpkin and I like this sky blue. 
and it has like warts on it and it has like little diamonds or little things on it i really like it over here it's just plain and then at the end it has like little designs and i actually got this at home goods and it was on sale for um six dollars or five dollars so i took advantage of that um it has things because i was doing makeup so um i'm not i'm trying to be careful because my vanity is why i'm not trying to get it dirty next thing we have this mirror I actually got this little vanity mirror at Bed Bath Beyond and it was um, $49.99 I believe. Um, it's cool because it has this light. I don't like the light that well but I mean hey it works great. Um, you can look at yourself and you can also zoom in. I think it's like 10 or 9 times you can zoom in but it's really cool i really like this mirror you can also flip it around and i just like it. it's really cute i want to get a white one so it could match like with my vanity a little bit more but yeah next thing we have this oops i have my coffee here i got this little cute couches i thought they were so cute you can like store jewelry in here i have my little necklace uh it's really cute I have this one as well. I like them because they're just so adorable. I just fell in love with it. And you can just store stuff, you know? Necklace. Normally, I like to store necklace, jewelry, rings. When I get, get home, I just want to, like, toss it in there and, you know. Um, but these are $9.99 each. And I got them at R.C. Willie as well. Um, if you guys don't know what's R.C. Willie, R.C. Willie is a furniture store. I think there's one here in Nevada, uh, California. And Utah so if you guys live in those areas please check them out they have great deals amazing stuff and you guys should check them out so then I have this lamp right here which is on um, I really like it I got this at Bed Bath Beyond it's so cute and normally I have a lamp here because I'm reading books or normally I'm doing homework on this desk or like writing or doing my makeup so I use this lamp just to give me more light when I'm reading or doing stuff um, I normally charge my tablet my Apple watch my iPhone my camera so I use this to charge and it's really cool it's very convenient something to like to put stuff here I p normally put my Apple watch when I get from home I just put it here just to instead of leaving it anywhere just like to keep it organized normally i don't keep makeup here because like i said i do my makeup yeah but i'm right next to it that's where i have my makeup but i also like to do my homework i like to read just relax a little bit just be on my phone so normally i just like to keep this just plain a little bit so i don't like to keep makeup because obviously look what happened this will happen so i normally put like a little um a little towel and i place my makeup or sometimes i bought this little like container where i can store my makeup when i'm doing my makeup but yeah so this is what it looks like and this mirror i actually got this mirror at um rc woolly it was on sale for fifty dollars and i took advantage of that it's so cute it is definitely not used it's brand new i just like it because it has this little like goldish and silver which is really pretty and sorry you can see me but I'm using my phone because my camera's charging um but it's so cute I really love this mirror so much it just sits well with my vanity and yeah so then I'm thinking I'm gonna add candle holders I was gonna get two candle holders add now I have my little uh, vanity here um this vanity is all white and it has chrome or it looks like chrome and it's cute it's actually a desk and but I created my own vanity just so cute I love it it has two drawers and it's all white obviously anything on top of the desk just because I don't want to prevent it from getting scratched or getting stained from makeups perfumes Mostly my perfumes and my skincare products, I keep it in my bathroom. And it's just a habit, you know, it's just I like to keep it there. So, yeah. So, when I open my drawers, I have is just eyeshadow palettes. Um, I have my Tarte Toasted Palette. Um, I'm pretty weird because I always keep the little um, containers, not containers, 
I like to keep it in storage in back in their palettes. Um, I got the ColourPop Golden State of Mine. So I got the. I like to keep it very organized. Um, I don't like to get it all dirty. Um, just like to keep it clean, clean and organized. I also have the Makeup Revolution Ultra Shadows, and then I have the Tardis Pro Glow Palette. This is my favorite. And then I have the um, Gold Goddess Eyeshadow Palette. Um, I got this, I think, at Kohl's. It's really cool. I got my one. I only have one Morphe palette. It's the 3502 Second Nature palette. And I actually got this on Ulta because they're starting to carry Morphe makeup. So I'm really happy because normally um, Ulta, you can use a 20% off coupon. And I normally get free shipping. So it's really cool. And you save money, 20% off. And <clears throat> I have this Rimmel Linden um, blush edition eyeshadow palette. I have this Too Faced Sweet Peach palette. I love this palette. And the eyeshadow that I'm wearing right now, and I'm using the Sweet Peach. I have the Urban Decay Heat palette. And then I have my Anastasia palette, which is a prism palette. It is a modern um, Anastasia palette. And then have the Sculpture palette. I'm just missing the Soft Glam palette, which I'm dying for right now. But yeah, this is the only palette that I have. I like to keep it really organized because it's just me. And that's how my mom raised me. Keep it clean and organized. You know, you know the drill, people. Um, I have more palettes. Um, so I have the LA, LA Colors eyeshadow palette, Struck Smoky, and then I have the Revolution by Soap X. I love this palette. I have the Cargo Getaway. I actually got this at Marshalls. It was $9.99. Good deal. I also got the BH Cosmetics Shannon XO eyeshadow palette. Then I have the Anastasia Glow Kid. Um, I need to start using this. I'm just too lazy to open the drawers because I have so many. I have to dig in there. Then I have the by Academic of Color. This is actually a highlight shade palette. I have the <clears throat> bronze. This is actually really pretty. I um, have not used it yet. I don't think I have not. Then I have this peach palette palette which i did a tutorial on it and it's really pretty but the shades did not work out so well and i have the Blurberry shadow palette this is actually really pretty you can actually do like a very pinky soft look with this and then i have the white and wild beauty book this is actually a shadow um palette they carry like so many colors you can actually use so i have not used this yet but i'm definitely going to i think i used it once but my brother got it for me for christmas it's very thought of him i have this gel three eye gel packs i think i only used one i think i used twice then i have the urban decay color nude um i always keep their boxes as a habit then i have the next contour it's really cute it has two highlighters and a blush and shadow shades then I have this boxy charm pure cosmetic um, I got this in my boxy charm and then I have this Ofra um, storage palette I only have one shade and then I have the LA colors face palette I have not used this yet I'm definitely going to do a video on that and yes yeah, pretty much it so in the bottom, I storage like books, my laptop, charger, and stuff like that. I also have like little markers, um, pencils for projects for school or stuff like that. I keep that in that container. Um, normally, um, I like to keep stuff in here. Sorry if you see my feet. <laughs> um, I don't wear shoes around the house, especially when it's carpet. I like to keep my carpet really, really clean. And I just cannot walk with shoes in the carpet. It's just a habit. Then I have my jewelry box in here. I store my jewelry. And then I have that on top. The top is where I mostly use kind of jewelry. Um, <laughs> I get my jewelry like at Kohl's, JCPenney, um, 
at Express, um, K Jewelry, and yeah. So I just like to keep my jewelry in here, but I keep the ones on top because that's the mainly ones that I use so often. Now we're gonna start with makeup. Uh, normally I keep my brushes here. I have the Wet n Wild brushes. I have them separately because they're like my favorite brushes. Then I have the Real Techniques. I got this in Amazon. These are the Bless eyeshadows pencils. I got these at Kohl's. And then I actually got the Vintage. I got them in my Boxy Charm. Then I got um, the Chrome um, eyeshadow brushes. And then I have the Real Techniques. These are the e.l.f. brushes and then I have more e.l.f. brushes right here and then let me see these are the BH Cosmetics uh, this is a Smashbox brush and the Anastasia brushes right here and yeah you know they're very affordable I really like them I have no complaints about them and then this little thing is a placemat. Um, you can, it's actually like for dining or patio and stuff like that. But I actually fold it. I put it on top of this because it is chrome. I don't want it to get scratched or prevent, prevent from getting dirty. So I put this on top of it so that way it won't scratch this um, makeup drawer. Like $2 and I got it at um, Target. It's really cute because it's gold. It has these little leaves on it around it which is really cute. I like it. This container I use this like to storage makeup. Um, normally uh, when I'm doing my makeup or makeup tutorials I put everything what I need because obviously I don't want to get this dirty because look what happened. So yeah. And then here is this I got this little bag, an Ipsy bag. It says Peace Love Lipstick. And I definitely just keep like all my sponges in here. Um, I have like the Eco and the Real Techniques. And then I have the Tarte one. It's all the way in the bottom. But yeah, I keep all my sponges in here. And I actually got this drawer at Michael's. Um, I do have another one, but it's in my mother's room. My room is really small, so it can only fit one at the moment. So I have this, but this is actually chrome. I think there's two colors, a gold and a chrome, but I'm not so sure. But there is only chrome in the store. Normally, I like to buy my Michael's. I got it for $37, and plus, I use a 30% off coupon it actually comes with 10 drawers which is really really cool i really like that um little like knobs on it which is so cute and then this is plastic which is cool because it's easy to clean as you can prevent from dusting stains and all that so really like that so the first drawer i have my elf cleaning cloth i have my what is this my moist mom I have my eyelashes, my first eyelashes actually, because I'm still learning. And my drunk elf and skincare products. I have my primer L'Oreal. I have my context eye cream. I love this. I always put them on in the morning. I have tape just when I do my eyeshadows. And then I have this uh, Shea moisturizer hydration. I use that at night before bed. And then I have this elf mineral infused primer this is actually amazing i just use it like on my chin and actually where my cheekbones are at because that's where i get more pores i have this remo linden insta flawless primer it's clear it's so amazing it's so soft i like it so much and then i have this nyx glitter primer so amazing it's easy to apply with glitters and i just love it i have my bare minerals um what is this Bare Minerals Infusion. I like I have my EOS lip balm, and then I have this Avena moisturizer. I love this so much. My Wet n Wild primer, and then what is this? Um, Sermon from Candela. I think that's how you pronounce it. But yeah, that's all I have. My primers, my oils, and stuff. That's where I normally keep it second drawer i have my primers um i have my mac primer urban decay all nighter uh, long lasting setting spray i have my tarte ready set radiant um 
Miss, Setting Mist, and then I have Amara Badescu, and then I have Ulta Makeup Setting Spray. I have my Milani and the Elf Setting Spray to keep it in their box. Then I have this next glitter. I love this. I actually got this at Kohl's, and it was actually on sale for $7. It also came with a little small primer. Then I got this Volgine Lapse Restore. I love this so, so, so much. It just keeps my face so fresh, so cooling. And I actually got it at Marshalls for $5.99. And then I have this Joe's Amarni Oil, Organic Oil. I love this. And it's actually great for dry skin. And I actually got this at Sephora. And yeah, so normally I just keep like my Sermon Oil product setting spray and yeah so just that next glitter is just hanging with them the third drawer i have um like i said it looks a mess because i don't have a second one so i have to keep one in my room because my room is really small so right here is mixed with everything i keep my um i have wet and wild um lipsticks um this one is the shade give me mocha i have nyx lipsticks lip creams and i have this innocence lip gloss it's actually my favorite then i have this Ades uh lipstick the lorac um lipstick and it's like both lipstick and lip gloss and then i have um my New York and Company lipsticks and then here I have the artistic signature color and the shade I didn't say um and then I have my academic the colors lipsticks I have lip um, mirrors they're all the way in the back but I just keep them here um I have some more actually yeah so and then this one is from l'oreal and i have more lipsticks lip liners um and then i have maybelline these are actually the best guys i like this maybelline lipstick this one is driver and then this one is pull up so i really like this um and then i have the tarte one um i actually got this for a giveaway shout out to abby thank you so much for the gift and then I have this Ulta lipstick. Actually, this doesn't even go here. So yeah, mostly they're like drugstore lipsticks. Um, I just lip creams and I just like to keep it in here. Uh, they're very affordable and they're very nice. Normally, I like to get them on sale. The fourth drawer, I have like lipsticks here. I don't have much here, but I have the, um, what is this? L'Oreal lipstick. I have Milani. Ooh, this is actually a pretty color. It's matte darling. I have my chapstick because my lips are always dry and I always, always, always have dry lips. And then I have um Soap and Glory lipstick. This one is the shade Rosy Cheek. And then I have the um what is this? This one is Raj Demarni. I think that's how you pronounce it. And then I have the um, Clinic um, lipstick. This one is Shanty. And then I have a lip primer from Ulta. I have more NYX lipsticks. And then this one is from CoverGirl. Yep. And this one is the shade Ebrora. I don't know how to pronounce it. Then I have a Milani lipstick lip liner sorry lip liner i think this one's the shade nude yep nude and they have this lipstick and um sleek major matte lipstick and this one is violet sleeper and they have innocence um lipstick as well and then i have dory addict this one is the shade rose hollywood it's really cute and 753 and they have this lipstick from N07 this one is the shade what is the shade pink lemonade it's a cute color and yeah that's pretty much I have for lipsticks I don't have much in here um but yeah 
Oh, and I have this. This is just so amazing. This is for my cold sore, and it works so much. It lasted for a week, but, you know, it's worth it. Here, I have my concealers. I have samples of concealers here. I have a Milani um, concealer. This one is the shade Light. I have e.l.f. lipstick. I have the Ulta Beauty. This is actually the best concealer. I love that so much. Then I have the um, Remo Linden Breathable Concealer. Um, I have the Maybelline Concealers here. I got the Fair and Light. I'm running out. I need to get more. I have the Wet n Wild Concealer. I have the Nars Concealer. And I have this um, Unique Mineral Touch Concealer. And I have the Makeup Revolution Concealer. I got the O1 and C11. Then I have this uh, Maybelline Master Conceal. I actually use this for like pimples or acne. I like to cover this because it works so good. If you guys want to cover something, this actually is amazing to cover. And then I have this NYX Concealer. And the CoverGirl Concealer. I really didn't like that. Then I have the um, LA Girl Pro Concealer. They have the Maybelline Concealer. really like this. As you can see, it's like going down. Then I have the Tarte Concealer. I love this so much. And then I have this Tarte's Pro Glow um, Highlighter. Um, I don't use this as a highlighter. I just like to mix it with my foundation because I just like it to glow more. So that's pretty much I have for concealers. The next drawer, I have foundations a lot i have the l'oreal uh inflammable pro matte and then i have the inflammable pro glow i really like this especially for the summer because i want my face to glow more and it just gives this very shiny glow in your face really like that this one i like to wear like at night because it's not that hot or like in the winter because it's really nice and then i have this ulta beauty hd focus foundation and then i have this la girl um coverage and white foundation i have my milani foundation i have my next foundation and then the white and wild photo focus foundation I have the it cosmetics which i'm wearing right now i really like this so much so amazing can't wait to get the bigger size in the mail and then I have this uh, Rimmel Linden Lasting Finish 24 Hour Breathable. I really like it. Um, it's just that I will wear it probably in the winter. And I have this Maybelline Super State Matte Foundation. I love this so much. But like I said, I will wear it in the winter because it's super matte. It just makes my face really weird. And I have dry skin. So, yeah. And then I have this Rimmel Stay Matte Foundation. And then this Wet n Wild Cushion Foundation. And then I have this L'Oreal True Match Lumen. I love this. It's so glowy and it fills your face so fresh. And I have this BB Cream from Maybelline. When I'm lazy, I just like to wear that. Then I have this Maybelline Foundation. I have the Dewy, actually. Dewy and Smooth. This one is the shade... I don't know. This one is the shade Classic Ivory. This one I have no idea, but it looks dark. Normally, I love this LA Girl foundation. It's really amazing. Makes my face look dewy, illuminating. It's just so amazing. I love this so, so, so much. It's my first, my go-to. Even the Egg Cosmetic makes my skin lightweight, which I really love. The next drawer I have is mixed with pressed powders, blushes, and a few highlighters. So I have this... Um, Rimmel Linden Insta Fix Matte, which I'm wearing right now. I have the Rimmel Linden Stay Matte. I love this so much. This Wet n Wild Ombre Brush and the Tarte Blush, the Ultra Mineral Blush. I have the Kat Von D, a Golden Translucent. The other one's in my mom's bathroom because I always forget makeup and I always leave it there. I have my Ultra Beauty, um, Ultra Beauty Press Powder. Then I have this um, Maybelline Loose Powder. I really love this. It's just very messy. And then I have this Tarte um, Highlighter, which is really, really cute. I really like this. It's actually one of my favorite highlighters. And it's what it looks like. So cute. Then I have this um, Benefit Cosmetic. I actually got the pack to see how good they are. It comes with like eight 
blushes I believe and for $20 and really like them but I used my reward so I basically got it for $5 for the whole pack then I have my wet and wild blush this one's mellow wine this one is apricot in the middle I love the apricot in the middle and then I have the rose champagne and then I have this LA girl blush this one is the shade just glowing then I have this Mary Kay blush. This one is, doesn't say the color, strawberry cream. Then I have this Maybelline Master Holographic highlighter. And then I have L'Oreal glitter highlighter. And I have this e.l.f. highlighter. It's terrible. I don't like it. I hated it. And then I have this Physican Formula Blush. And this one is the shade um, Blushing Rose. I like this. And then I have this highlighter. I don't know where is it from, but I got it from Sephora. And I love it so much. Then I have this um, What's Up highlighter from Benefit. And then the Makeup Revolution highlighter. And then what else? the Bomb Village highlighter. Um, the Innocence Blush. So cute. I like this blush. And then I have the Benefit Hula Light Bronze Powder. And that's pretty much I have. Oh, I have this Ultra Highlighter as well. It's Illuminating Powder. It's really amazing. I like it. And it's so affordable. Okay. The next drawer. We're almost there. So this drawer is full of bronzers and pressed powders it's a little mix so i have this maybelline pressed powder and they have this tart to go palette i have the mini one i have the original size i have the stila cream contour actually got this at marshall's and it comes with the cream bronzer and a cream concealer i really like this a lot then i have the tart powder the hula bronzer is actually my favorite and then the butter bronzer wet and wild um this one is Take it to Brazil. Innocence Matte Bronzing Powder. And then I have the White and Wild Contouring Palette. Then I have this Ulta Matte Bronzer. And then the NYX Matte Bronzer. And I also have this Wet and Wild Contour and Hot Concealer Stick. Then I have the Innocence Contour Powder. And the Hula Powder. And I have this bronzer powder from CoverGirl. And I have the Wet n Wild pressed powder, which I like. Then I have this bronzer booster. It has a highlighter, two highlighters, and a bronzer. I think I have more stuff. Yep. Then I have the Rimmel Linden, um, like a little contour kit. And then I also have the Maybelline um, contour kit as well. Mm -hmm. Next one, oh, this is a mess actually. <sighs> um, I apologize for the mess, guys, but this is actually mixed with mascaras, eyeliners, brow gels, um, liquid eyeliners, and yeah. So I have my mascaras here: I have the Wet n Wild, Too Faced, and the Stila eyeliner, and. This one is the eyeshadow primer. I have my Maybelline mascara. And it has some little eyeshadow, like little compact eyeshadows. Um, Mary Kay. And this one. And then the Cover Girl. And this one. I don't know what that's from. Oh, shoot. This one. So I have these eyeshadows, which I don't use. I um, need to do a video what I want to get rid of. So I have these eyeshadows, and yeah. This is like a creamy shadow, which I really like. I use this one mostly. And then I have the Maybelline Total Imitation Mascara. I hate this mascara so much. It just gets my eyelashes all crumbed up together, which is so annoying. I have this Wet n Wild White <coughs> Eyeliner. And... The brow gel mascara from Mac and Wild, and I have this eyeshadow primer from Ulta. Then I have this 
powder um, from Maybelline. I like this a lot. I have this eyeliner I used to like, but <laughs> kind of got tired of it. And then I have the next matte eyeliner and the Wet n Wild eyeliner pencil. Um, this one is the Wet n Wild brown pencil, which I'm loving, and the Maybelline eyeshadow. I mean, not an eyeshadow, eyebrow pencil. And this one is the Brow Gel Mascara. I have the NYX Brow Pencil. This is actually my favorite, too. And I have the Rimmel Linden Eyeliner. This eyeliner, it sucks. I hate it because it dries so quickly, and I hate it so much. They have this mascara from MAC, and this mascara is from Revlon. And I actually like this mascara from Mac. This Tarte mascara, I love so much. And the another mascara, it's cosmetic mascara, I love it a lot. Yeah, that's pretty much it. It's a mess, but my room's really small, so I hope you guys understand. And then here in the last row, I have my Maybelline Total Optician um, palette. I love this so much. I have my Ulta. Um, eyeshadow palettes here I have two of them and then I have my Lorac eyeshadow I love that eyeshadow palette so much got it for Christmas for my brothers and yeah so I'm gonna have this Tardis Pro Glow eyeshadow I love and then the Pure Cosmetic Bronzer M Brighton and then I have this Slick eyeshadow it's really small my mom actually gave this to me um, but I have not used it yet, so I'll probably use it. Then I have my Smashbox bronzer. I love this palette so much, guys. It's so amazing. I love it. Then I have my Milani eyeshadow palettes. I have my e.l.f., um, which I really like a lot. So cute. Look at that. And this one is, I think these are bronzers. Yep, these are bronzers. Two bronzers, a highlighter, and I think there's two highlighters. They have my Wet n Wild palette. And then I have this color workshop. I hate it so much. I'm gonna toss it away. I don't like it. They're not very pigmented. Um, and I have my NYX Highlight and Contour palette. And I think that's pretty much it. Whew, that is pretty much it, guys. Uh, that's all I have in this little um, makeup um, drawer. It's really nice, very convenient. It's so cute. I like it. Uh, like Alright guys, so I really hope you enjoyed my video. And please do not forget to like and subscribe to my channel. If you are new, welcome to the family. And yeah, so have a good day guys. And I'll see you next time. Bye guys.